हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक वंस अगेन टू आर चैनल गुरुकुल एक्सरसाइज 7.1 नंबर वन फर्स्ट पार्ट इट सेज वी हैव टू राइट द फॉलोइंग डेसिमल नंबर इन वर्ड्स सो द फर्स्ट इज 30.1 व्हिच कैन बी रिटन एज 30 पॉइंट फाइव नंबर बी जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री इट विल बी रिटर्न जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री सब पार्ट सी वन हंड्रेड एंड एट पॉइंट फिफ्टी सिक्स वी विल राइट वन हंड्रेड एंड एट पॉइंट फाइव सिक्स नंबर डी फोर्टी सेवन पॉइंट ट्वेंटी वी विल राइट फोर्टी सेवन पॉइंट टू जीरो नंबर ई फाइव पॉइंट जीरो जीरो एट वी विल राइट फाइव पॉइंट जीरो जीरो एट नंबर एफ Twenty six point zero three nine will be written as twenty six point zero three nine. Now, question number two, one. Now we have to show each of the decimal numbers in the place value chart. So for that we need to draw a place value table. This is the decimal point ones, tens, hundred. Thousand, and after decimal is tenth, hundred, thousandth. Yes. So number one, it says four point two. So we will write four in one column, and two is tenth because there is a point here. Four point two. Next number two. Zero point three. So zero we are going to write in ones column, and three will be written in tenths column. Number three, two hundred and five point nine. So two hundred and five means two hundred zero five, and point nine ninth will be at tenth place. Number four, zero point two nine. Zero comes under ones. And two nine two will be tenth, and nine will be hundredth. Next number five, two point zero eight. Two will be written below ones. Point zero is tenth, eight is hundredth. Number six seven thousand two hundred. So under thousand columns we will write seven. Under hundred columns we will write two zero zero. Point eight will be written under tenth, one will be written under hundredth, and two will be written under thousandth column. So seven thousand two hundred point eight one two. Next is thirty eight point zero zero seven. So thirty three will be under tenths and ones. Point zero zero seven. Next. we will turn the page and come to question number 
Question number 3 says that we have to expand the decimal number. The first is 123.7. Now this we have to write as 100 plus 20 plus 3 plus 7 by 10th. Because here 7 is under 10th place. Number 2. Forty three point zero six can be written as forty plus three plus six by hundred because six is at hundredth place. Number three five zero nine point three zero six can be written as five hundred plus nine plus 3 by 10 plus 6 by 1000 because your 6 is at 1000th place. This is 10th, 100 thousands. Now, question number 4. Now, they have already given in expanded form and we have to write as a decimal number. Number 1, it says 200 plus 60 plus 5 is, sorry, plus 3 by 10 is equal to 265.3. Next question, subpart 2, 50 plus 1 by 10 plus 6 by 100. That comes down to 50.16. Number 3, 70 plus 6 plus 7 by 10 plus 9 by 1000 will give us 76.709. Plus 3 by 100 plus 6 by 1000 will give us 607 point. Now 3 is on 100 that means 10th place is there is no figure that means we will write 0 then 3 and 6. Now we will come down to some number 5 where we have to write each of the following as decimal. It says 2 ones and 5 tenth. That means 2.5. Number 2, it says 2 tenths and 9 tenth. 2 tenths means 20.9. Number 3, it says 600.8. 600.8 Number 4 It says 205 So 205 and 500 That means point zero five. 5 is at 100th place And no figure is at 10th place So we will write a 0 here Number 5 says 7 and 15,000 so, 7.015 is the answer. Now, sum number 6, 1. Please follow the book. They have already given the table. Everything is given in tabulation form. And then we have to write in a decimal form. 6, 1. 7,102. Let me write. 7102 point now at 10th place they have 3 100 place is 0 and 1000 place is 6 this is the answer number 2 211 point 902 number 3 is 3000 
Number four, it is seventy point zero three. Number five, it is five point four zero. Number six, it is seven hundred nineteen point zero two eight. So number seven, show the following decimal number. On the number line. So for that, we first have to draw a number line. This is zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is. One, two, three, and this goes on. So now this is five point five one, one point five two, two point five three. Now we have to show point four. So this point is zero point four. One point five six seven eight. Nine. This is one point nine. Number two. Number three. It is one point one. So one point one. This one. One point one. Number three. Number four. Two point five. Two point five. This is two point five. Number four. Question number eight. It says, write the decimal number represented by the points A, B, C, and D on the given number line. So now let us count. This is zero, point one, point two, point three, point four, point five, point six, point seven, point eight. So A is zero point eight. Now B. This is one. 1.2 1.3 sorry 1.1 1.2 1.3 1 is 1.3 c this is 2 2.1 2.2 c is 2.2 number d 2.2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 D is two point nine. Now, sum number nine. First part it says between which two numbers in tenth place on the number line does each of the given number lies? Now, tenth place means here we are talking about zero. So zero lies between. Zero point zero and zero point one. Number two, ten place is four, so four lies between zero point four and zero point five. Number three, ten place is six, so it lies between zero point six and zero point seven. Number four, at tenth place we have nine, so that lies between zero point nine and one. Thank you, friends, for watching my video, and please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel.